Well, how you doing? Channel Devito 28 hasn't had a video for a long, long time now, has it? No, no, no. Well, I decided to give it a go, you know, throw one up there. <laughs> See what happens. So the thing is, this channel was all about my dog, Vito. Hence the name, Dog Vito. I just took the G out of the middle for all you people that can't work that out. But there you go, Dog Vito, Dog Vito. That's where that comes from. Dig it? Yeah? Well, <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing or saying. I just made this video. You see, the thing is, I've got a few things I want to say. I want to say this to friends, family, people that don't know me, people that pretend to know me, you know, people that pretend to be your friends. There's a lot of them about, you know, users is what they are. Uh, as long as they're getting their own way, hey. Eh? But you know, basically, I wanted to make a video because I talk to my, uh, I talk to my friends, my family about a lot of things, but I don't truly tell anybody the way it is. So I don't think people will truly understand or grasp it, you know. Now a couple of times recently, I've tried to open up to a couple of people, you know, and one of those people was this gentleman right here, Riley the Roofer, Big Daddy, quality geezer, absolute quality diamond geezer, so much respect and love for that man, quality guy, he sent me this hoodie, which is keeping me very, very warm, it really is, believe me, when I tell you this, alright, I have something called fasciocapular humeral muscular dystrophy, which basically means my muscles are dying and they have always been dying since you know forever they deteriorate right they grow at a certain point and they start deteriorating and now they're at a pretty bad stage i haven't got a lot of meat on my bones you know i'm a lot i'm quite skin on bone in a lot of places and uh i get cold very easy now I'm 36 now, when I was 29 I was in hospital with pneumonia. Now this nearly killed me. That morning I woke up in bed, absolutely couldn't breathe, I'm trying not to swear, <laughs> um, I couldn't breathe, I had nothing, I was choking on my own, you know, the, the, the phlegm, the build up, if you've ever had pneumonia, you'll know what it's like, it's a, it's a thick yellow mucus, and it's, it's sticky, and it's solid, and I was choking on this stuff, couldn't breathe, managed to get to the phone, managed, to, I heard this say I was 29, uh, 28 at the time, you know, um, I managed to get out of bed, get to the phone, Told the ambulance, told them I managed to get the words out. I was breathing through my nose, just about sort of. I was choking and I was in a bad way. And the ambulance got here and they went, Mate, you're lucky. You're lucky you managed to make that phone call because if you hadn't have done, that would have been it. So I went in and I was in for a few weeks and I was in there on my 29th birthday. So I uh, could have been. <laughs> could have died then when I was seven I had whooping cough it's another bad thing could have died then a couple of times you know in life I could have could have gone already but you know I'm, I'm still here and I'm 36 and this is one of the things that bothers me is how do I plan for a future if I don't know that I've got a future. Just like that, when I was 28 and I got that pneumonia and it could have been it right there and then that says, what's next? What do you plan for? What do you do? How do you move forward from here? And I did things. I did things. I went out. I did a lot with the wrestling, you know, and done shows. I worked with wrestlers and promotions and I've done a lot of stuff, you know, and... I am now, now at a stage where my disability is so bad, I can barely move. 
I can't get myself in and out of bed. And there's a lot of other things I can't help myself do. You know, I can't get dressed on my own anymore. I can put a jumper on and a t-shirt, but trousers, no chance. Sucks, I can barely reach my feet. I don't sleep because I can't sleep. I sleep occasionally and then sometimes I sleep a lot when I crash. But I do have to crash. And that can be three or four days. You know? On average I may get an hour, two hours. I don't sleep in my bed because I can't sleep in my bed. My body will not allow it. My body aches. My body, there's a lot of pain. My bones, the very bones, ache. They, the, the pressure, the cinnamon. You know, I think I've not been diagnosed with arthritis or anything, you know, but that's because I don't go to the doctor or the hospital that often. I go when I'm dying <laughs> or when I think, I'm, you know, I'm going to need antibiotics like a chest infection or a throat infection. You know, but I'm not, I'm not a doctor type dude. You know, I, just, I won't, I won't, I won't go for just anything. You know, I, it has to be bad, and you know, I don't know. But my knees, my bones, my joints, everything must be the equivalent of what it's like to have arthritis, because everything hurts. And if I lay in bed, I stretch, I move. Not having it. On top of that, my mind runs at a million miles an hour. I'm always thinking. I'm very scientific. Um, I'm very into, you know, evolution, the cosmos, the planets, you know, chemistry, biology, physics, just in general. I'm big into science, you know. I love it. Um, you know, and I love my wrestling. Of course, that's my whole deal. You know, if you know anything about me, you'll know when I was seven years old, that is what I decided I wanted to do. And I lived, I lived my all-consuming every day thing I did was wrestling. And I did that. When I was 12, they told me, you got muscular dystrophy, fascio scapular humeral muscular dystrophy, and you're going to be in a wheelchair by the time you're 16. And I said, no. No, I don't want that. That's not going to happen to me. And that broke my fucking heart. You understand that? That crushed me. Devastated me. I was 12 years old. And it changed everything from that day forward. You know, school wasn't particularly easy. I wasn't an unpopular guy. I was quite popular. I got on with more or less everyone. And, you know, but I had my fair share of fights with people. You know, people that wanted to step up, so to speak, but things were dealt with the way they were dealt with back then, and that's how things were, it wasn't, you know, we didn't really consider it bullying each other, it was, <laughs> it was pecking order, you know, that's how it was then. But I never really had much problem with people at school, really. I went on to do four years. I don't, I'm losing the losing the uh, track here. I'm losing my focus. That's what I'm saying. My mind moves at a million miles an hour, and I can't think of just one thing. It's like a million things, and I have to describe every single one of them in new, incredibly immense detail. But I can't do that right now. I'm trying to keep this video under six minutes, and it's already nine. So <laughs> I don't know. Um, I don't know what these, uh, what I'm gonna do on this channel from this day forward. But I just, I don't know. I wanted to start making videos again because I have become very antisocial due to my health. You know, I know. This is, I think, the point of what I'm trying to say is I need to make these videos. Because whether I make a thousand more or whether I only make another ten, I need to put something out there so people know what's what about what and, you know, maybe learn something from someone. I'm not 
anybody important. Nobody's perfect, so I'm a nobody. I always say that. You know? My opinion is mine. My thoughts are mine. They shouldn't necessarily influence or offend others. But sometimes they do. But you know, there's a lot of things I could be doing, should be doing right now. I have a little hobby, it's uh, an e-fed called YTWE 18 plus, I'm sure a few of you may have heard about it, but it's 10 to 5 in the morning, Sunday morning, and I've got to put the show out today, um, but I haven't done fuck all yet, I've got to do Moomay versus Rant with Jeff, Mr. DeVito versus Boston Fan. And there's a few other bits and pieces that will go on now. But I ain't done none of it and it's going to take me a good four or five hours just to do that. And then obviously you've got to commentate over the top of it, got to do all that. And you know, sometimes I just can't be fucked. I really can't, but I do. And I do it for the people involved, you know. Like today, Moomay, Mistress Moomay, Moose, she's an amazing lady such a lovely lady she really is and you know i'm happy to always you know do that because i know when she watches it it makes her day and it, it you know it uplifts her and that's that's what that's about and you know rent with jeff boston fan you know they appreciate it they respect it you know and they put so much in and i, I want to give that back to guys like that you know people like that you know and th there's so many I do it for the reason I do it, you know, I enjoy it. So I will, I will sit here for the next four or five hours, six hours, whatever it takes to get that show done, even though, honestly, I really don't want to. Because I can't be bothered. I can't, I'm tired, but I can't sleep. I ache physically, and I can't do fuck all about that. But I don't know, well this is 12 minutes, so I'm going to leave it here for now. And I want you all out there, every single one of you watching, every single last one of you, to so have a good night, good morning, good Sunday. Respect to you all, to my friends, family, people watching this, you'll go, what's he talking about? I don't know. Face it, it's 10 to 5 in the morning. <laughs> I'm making a damn video. So this is DeVito28. Yes, I guess we are back in business to some extent. Although there will be one major change and that is that Vito is no longer with us. My dog, the reason this channel exists, the very name DeVito. It was Dog Vito. I took the G out. That's for all of you that can't figure that <laughs> can't figure that out but yeah there you go so this is the VO28 and this is going to be the first in a number of videos I haven't connected this to my Google Plus account so therefore will not be able to comment as the VO28 underneath but will try to reply to comments as YTWE18 Plus PS the VO you know my uh, gaming channel so um, yeah ladies and gentlemen have a great night thank you for watching come back and tell your friends to subscribe because it's the VO28 oh yeah